A teenager taken nearly 200 miles away and brought right here to San Antonio. Investigators say the human trafficking case led to two arrests. Social media apparently played a role in luring the 15-year-old girl from her home in Houston. The night team's Petty Santos tells us this all unfolded last week and those two arrests made just hours ago. Yeah, those arrests involved an 18 year old and a 35 year old from here in San Antonio and the churches said they are facing range from human trafficking and aggravated assault of a child. Take a look. That's Carolyn Mitchell on her way to booking tonight. Investigators say she was con she contacted the 15 year old over Snapchat and the cash app. Deputy say Mitchell convinced her to have sexual intercourse with her and Rondell Lee Peterson for $2,400. We're told that the pair drove up to meet with a teen again Friday of last week, and that's when deputies say the victim was taken against her will and brought back to San Antonio, where she was allegedly raped by Peterson. She was dumped Saturday in shirts, where she called 911 and was able to lead investigators to the two suspects. It's happening right here. They're after our kids on our streets, uh, on their own cell phones, uh, and we have to absolutely have to prepare our kids for what to look out for. Now, granted, this young lady, uh, although she is not of an age where she can consent to sexual activity, um, was was involved in, in some of this activity uh, by social media and, and, of course, living that high-risk lifestyle. And the victim, we can tell you tonight, is back in Houston with her family. BCSO says they found a large amount of cocaine and an AK-47 in the apartment where the suspects were arrested. Tonight, detectives are trying to determine if this is part of a larger ring and if there are any more victims. Devin?